Welcome to Kids Easy Learning. Make sure to subscribe to become a part of our KEL family because we post new videos every Thursday. Also, don't forget to give this video a huge thumbs up. For this experiment, you will need a balloon, a pair of scissors, paper, and a comb. A small piece of paper will be totally fine. Time for some kids easy learning magic. There you go. We have tiny bits of paper. Now take your comb and rub it in your hair. This makes the comb negatively charged. When you rub the comb in your hair, the electrons from your hair get transferred to the comb and hence the comb gets negatively charged. Let us see what it does when it's brought near bits of paper. Did you notice that? Let's look at it a bit more closer. That seemed like magic. When the comb was brought near the bits of paper, it attracted the bits of paper. What really happens is the part of the paper that is positively charged gets attracted to the negatively charged comb. All this happens because opposite charges attract each other, which means that a negative charged particle will attract a positive charged particle. However, like charges repel. Two positively charged particles will repel each other and the same with two negatively charged particles. Let us try the same thing with a balloon this time. I chose this bright yellow balloon here. Either use your mouth or use a pump to inflate the balloon. Now time for some negative charge. Rub the balloon in your hair. Now see what happens. The balloon works exactly like a comb and because of its negative charge from our hair, it attracts the positive charged paper. You can do this activity with a comb as well as with a balloon, but I felt that it worked much better with a balloon. Thanks for watching. Make sure to search for Kids Easy Learning whenever you want to watch educational videos. Make sure to subscribe to join the KEL family and give this video a huge thumbs up. We post new videos every Thursday, so make sure to come back next Thursday for more.